on July 7, 1919, the first military convoy set out to test how well the military could move across the country in the event of war. They left from the White House. They drove along the Lincoln Highway, what existed of it at the time. Despite several setbacks, including 230 breakdowns, they arrived in San Francisco with 72 of the 81 vehicles. This is actually the 90th anniversary, we feel, of the beginning of the interstate highway system in America. We're going to start here and retrace this convoy route for the first time using military vehicles. Transition to present day. At the same starting point, decades later, an assortment of history buffs and car enthusiasts attempt to relive the venture. Thousands of people will be able to view this, and we expect to have 50 to 100 vehicles online all the time. Vehicles that came from every little corner of the world. I found out about eBay. It spent its life in California as a follow me Jeep at an airport. We find these out behind barns and who knows where, restore them, and it's a way to share history. It's an adventure. An adventure for one of the group's youngest drivers who carries an extra burden. My car is uh, the oldest that's going the whole way. It has narrow wheels and it goes into ruts and likes going to different lanes so you have to really actively drive it. It's going to be an adventure to see even if the car gets there. I've always wanted to do a long, long trip with it so here's the opportunity for to drive my 1941 Willys Jeep from coast to coast before I get too old. I want you to look at each other. And simply say, Hoo -ah! And though the drivers will gray and the cars will rust, the memory of that 3,000 mile trek will remain as timeless as history. Anna Allen, Washington.